Okay, my project, Nuclear is Good, What Will It Take to Convince You, looks at nuclear energy policy in the UK. And it started from the point where last year in the UK the government announced the rolling out of 11 new nuclear power stations in order to meet our CO2 emissions targets. And within that context, my proposals look at how you might go about putting forward a convincing argument for nuclear energy. And over the last 60 years, science has somehow failed to deliver on that convincing argument. And my proposal is to look at what other tools we can employ, what other tools we can use to think about how we might kind of put forward that convincing argument, uh, a convincing argument that's entirely necessary, I think. Now, my project isn't necessarily propaganda. It's about opening up a debate about nuclear energy and energy policy in general and also how you might go about engaging with a larger, slightly intangible um, policy scale question, how you might go about looking at decision making more generally. Um, my projects stem from, or the proposals that I'm showing as part of Nuclear is Good, stem from existing precedents and taken to their logical conclusions, some of which are uh, looking at kind of pandering to perceived hazards and others look at incentivising the uptake of nuclear and uh, how that might be done in a convincing manner. So they range from a protective barrage cloud uh, where I look at introducing whole new infrastructure that might allay some of the fears around an accident like wind scale fire or Chernobyl and how you might engineer a solution that could solve that to uh, how you might deal with the nuclear waste burden in the same way that carbon rationing is a particular model and how you might look at the nuclear waste burden in a more creative way and look at a different policy altogether because one teacup of nuclear waste is one person's lifetime of electricity so suddenly it refigures the whole values of nuclear and my each of the proposals that I've come up with look at different parts of policy and how you might engage with those. Um, one of the outcomes and how I approached this uh, project was in order to design an argument, how you might go about designing a convincing argument for the rolling out of this policy. And one of the outcomes that it was a walking, talking, guided tour to the site of a potential new nuclear power station in Essex in the UK. And I basically took some nuclear engineers from Nuclear First, which is a doctoral training centre for uh, nuclear professionals, the Essex Arts and Environments Officer, some designers, some tutors, and presented these proposals as part of this tour. And actually that was a way of stimulating a whole range of debate that you wouldn't otherwise be able to get to as, as kind of sitting in a room discussing those things. Uh, and that was a very interesting way of engaging with these larger policy scale questions, which is what I'm interested in doing. I think that's all I'll say about that. My name's Oliver Goodhall, and I've just completed an MA at the Royal College of Art.